here on ESPN in his debut, the number one pick. And first, a key Eastern Conference matchup. And Horford and the Sixers have it first. In Toronto, especially as of late, get off the cold shooting starts, having to recover late. Siakam for three, and that ties the game. I need to learn how to shoot. Yeah. Simmons, finger roll wouldn't go, but one of the best rebounding guards in the NBA puts it back up in it. See, Corkmoff's just giving him a cushion because <laughs> he knows there's a blow by possibility. Speaking of which, Ben Simmons. It's just so hard to guard. If he gets his shoulders past you downhill, turn it over. Nice. And here comes Simmons downhill again, setting up Horford. Second bucket for Horford. In a, such a big topic of discussion, whether or not he and Joel can coexist perfectly because it, it hasn't looked great. Right. And, and I think that's the challenge is another three goes down for Marcus Gasol. Post-up guy. Right. But also fit in this guy right here. Horford, the extra pass to an excellent shooter in Furkan Korkmaz. And he said this all of last year. How do we land the plane? What, what do they do when it matters most? Right. Gasol, the turnaround and a smooth shot. A couple of blocks and a 12 of 14 shooting night for Ben Simmons. Cork Maz open again. Boy, the last couple of games you and I have seen Philadelphia were like, how do you keep leaving this guy open? You can tell Cork Maz is a player who's used to getting run off the three point line. That little floater was nice touch. Lowry on his way to the rim. Pay him on a full time deal if they wanted to keep him on the active roster. Not a lot of flexibility contract wise if Philadelphia wants to make a move, which has been a big topic of conversation as we get closer to the trade deadline. Look at the importance of the Toronto game right. relative to the East standings. Powell in transition to the rim. What do you think the disparity is? I know you talked to him a little bit about it. Yeah, I mean, the one thing I said is. Drive by Fred Van Vliet. Uh, he got dropped a little bit too. The flu got our man. So our best to uh, Ryan. As Serge Ibaka puts in the hook. By the way, our condolences to Ryan and his family with the loss of his grandfather. And Philadelphia trying to do it with most of its second unit on the floor right now. Harris beating Ibaka to the rim. Yeah, he's, he's got to be aggressive and assertive as a scorer. You can play him in pick and roll as the ball handler. Like, he, he brings a ton to the table. And he should have three and a couple of buckets in the... Davis, Van Vliet, Ibaka, and Powell, along with Hollis Jefferson. When you need a bucket with this unit on the floor, this is a good option. Fred Van Vliet has seven in the court. Natural reaction at this point. Like a whistle, you see your number called, and you go, oh, what are you talking about? That's a second strong drive to the rim for Norman Powell. Discipline by Thibel not to commit the foul. He already had two on him. Harris the turnaround. Oh! Tipped up and in by Simmons, and a foul. Listen, this has to be at the... Lowry, feeling the defense, able to penetrate. It's ex it, it took the words right out of my mouth. Will sometimes start and sometimes come off the bench, depending on matchup. Or is the team big? Well, we know what Gasol can do. He can pass it. A beautiful assist to Siaka. No player is going to admit that. But it is uncomfortable, right. at the very least. And here's what has to happen. As Toronto gets another basket, and they move it. I need one three again. Yeah. And from that point, he's not taking one. The Soul ties the game at 46. They come back from down 14. And Bible will trigger a quick one. Simmons tipped that one alive to Horford. It's a Harris three to put him back in front. Brown is out near midcourt in Mark Lindsay's ear asking about that foul. Siakam cutting. Gasol with the feed. It's a one-point game again. Personnel and philosophy. Milton off target. Gasol the rebound. Lowry back looking for Toronto's first lead of the game. To the rim. Put it in. Harris into the paint to set up Thibel for an open tray to put Philadelphia back in front. Yeah, and he finds him. He's got to shoot a good percentage on those because that's going to happen. Siakam all the way to the rim. Ties the game at 53. Growing up, he said his siblings all liked to play basketball and kind of didn't really want to do that, so he decided to back up, play any other sport he could. Harris answers with a three on an assist from Sim. Oh, tip by Thibel. Good read off the Gasol feed, and he'll take it all the way. They wanted a foul on the trailing Gasol. There's that famous sports performance laboratory, P3. And when he's in high school, 
Great ball reversal leads Excellent. to a nice three. Broke Jason Kidd's Pac-12 record with 126 last season. Here's Harris. Loves this spot on the floor, and he drains a three. Or for the rebound as Van Vliet hit the deck. It's five on four. Harris taking it inside. Lowry being hassled by Horford. That one just got past Thibel into the hands of Powell for a three. A much needed one at that. 22 on a pretty team friendly deal considering the level of production he's up this year. Good pass by Horford to Simmons. He's going to need to make when he's in the flow of the offense and open. Lowry slipped it to Siakam. Nice pocket pass to Serge Ibaka. And Brett Brown's going to call a timeout as Toronto's worked back within five. Good extra pass for a Horford three. Siakam had the closeout. Davis the rebound. Six point game inside a three for the third. Lowry with a head of steam to the rim. First field goal of the second half. He's coming in on four game win streaks. Third meeting of four between the two. Horford the extra pass to Korkmaz over the outstretched to Baca. Baca in the paint. Gets the friendly roll and he's into double figures. Korkmaz trying to stick with Van Vliet around the screen. Buries a three. One point game. Hollis Jefferson. Hit the deck. Deep one from Van Vliet. Van Vliet, the hedge from Neto. The kick to Lowry. On the drive. To the rim. Left hand is good. Largest lead of the game for Toronto at four. Golden State did dominating with Stephen Clay. But he's one of the elite shot makers in the NBA. If Baca buries a three, Toronto extends it out to eight. Late in the clock, it's Korkmaz stepping in with the runner from distance. I tell you, he, he's made several of those plays. Drive from Powell, the extension by Pell for the rejection. Neto back the other way for Philly. A kick to Scott, a big three. That cuts it back down to three. I think Zion Williamson slept last night. <laughs> I'm guessing no. I mean, still a rookie as Van Vliet hits another big three. The crossover Van Vliet to the rim. Harris stuck with him the entire way. Neto avoids Powell. Harris sets up Shake Milton and a big three again. But it was interesting. I, I think it was Brent Windhorst who did a piece on the dot com. Nice drive by Norm. Big time move. Lou Williams. Who am, I, who am I leaving out? Anyway, their best lineup has played, I think, a total of 46 oh, yeah. minutes. I saw that today as well. If Baca on the run out puts Toronto up by six. Brett Brown calls timeout. Orford battling. He had the smaller Powell on him. Runs away from the double. Kicks to Thibel. That's the three that Philadelphia was looking for. Simmons working downhill and gets shut off. Extra pass. Thibel again. Good again. Back to a three-point game. Out of this last stretch coming in where he was four for 25. Still shooting better than 40% from three-point range. Oh, Norman Powell just hiding the ball momentarily. To... And a scored 20. Plus in five straight games. Oh, Simmons tried to throw it down and got a lucky bounce. They were a desperate team. Yep. Boston had been struggling. They were at home. Quality win. Siaka muscling through the defensive Bible to give Toronto a six-point advantage. Leaves it for Van Vliet for Toronto's biggest lead. Van Vliet, the step back three. Got them all! An easy debut. Not that any debut is easy. There is significant weight on this game, especially after what the Pelicans have started to put together. Siakam will take it all the way. Part of an 18 point, 15 rebound night. A big fourth quarter led by Fred Van Vliet. Who finishes the game with 22 points, 6 of 7 from 3-point range. Norman Powell had 18.